Boris Johnson's Brexit envoy is warning Brussels to fully respect UK sovereignty ahead of intensive trade talks this weekend. Lord Frost will go head-to-head -head with EU negotiator Michel Barnier in London as the discussions resume after a delay triggered by a coronavirus scare. But the Downing Street Task Force Europe chief insisted his team will not compromise over Brussels' demands for continued meddling over regulations and fishing quotas. He spoke after Mr. Barnier complained that significant divergences between the two sides with time running out to agree on a trade deal ready to come into force when the UK's post-Brexit transition out of the EU single market and customs union concludes on January 1st. In a statement on Twitter, Lord Frost said, I look forward to welcoming Michel Barnier and his team to London and to resuming face-to-face -face talks tomorrow. We are glad all are safe and well. Some people are asking me why we are still talking. My answer is that it's my job to do my utmost to see if the conditions for a deal exist. It is late, but a deal is still possible, and I will continue to talk until it's clear that it isn't. But for a deal to be possible, it must fully respect UK sovereignty. That is not just a word, it has practical consequences. That includes, controlling our borders, deciding ourselves on a robust and principled subsidy control system, and controlling our fishing waters. We look to reach an agreement on this basis, allowing the new beginning to our relationship with the EU which, for our part, we have always wanted. We will continue to work hard to get it, because an agreement on any other basis is not possible, one source yesterday said Mr. Barnier will put forward a new compromise proposal for European fishing fleets to hand up to 18% of their catches in British coastal waters back to the UK. Downing Street officials declined to discuss the proposal but insisted Mr. Johnson will not give up the country's sovereignty over coastal fishing waters in the talks. The Prime Minister's spokesman said, Our negotiating principle remains that we will become an independent coastal state and we will retain control of our fisheries. He added, The talks will resume over the weekend on a face-to-face -face basis. We remain committed to seeking a free trade agreement but that must fully respect UK sovereignty. At this late stage, a deal is still possible and we are working to achieve one. We'll continue to negotiate over the weekend to that end. The spokesman said Mr. Johnson was prepared to abandon the negotiations, leaving the UK to trade with the EU without a deal in a similar fashion to Australia's relationship with the bloc, rather than compromise UK sovereignty.